Maxwell Ponderosa has the honor of refereeing this one, and his arm is being propped up by Trump Bruce Buffer. That's weird. Amazing. It's like he's doing that whose line is it anyway game where he's peeing his hands. But Holy shit, I know what you're talking about. Maxwell Ponderosa has no idea what's happening. And there you see Mrs. Zed. Ready? Ready? Uh, signifying that it is round one of a potential five minute rounds. This is huge, and Eamon Grunel gets the knockdown right off the bat. He is in the brown trunks. Wow. Teddy Grabowski in his signature yellow. And this is going to be an interesting fight. I, I really can't call it. It's so, it's a, there's so many, so many wild cards, so many variables involved. I mean, literally, I, I'm almost expecting someone to just yell wild card halfway through this fight. <laughs> wild card, bitches. There you go. Exactly, Randy. And, uh, I mean, Two of these fight, these two players both have the capability of winning with at, at the blink of an eye. I don't know if this is going to go to a distance. If this is going to be over in a round, it could be somewhere in the middle. I, it, it's so hard to predict, and that's why you can see our our fans have are, are almost 50-50 split with Grabowski getting the slight advantage, and he's starting off with some clinch fighting. Looking to tire down Grundle, force him to use his carry his weight. Oh, and Grundle strikes oh, first! Oh, shit, all right. right. He is laying into Grabowski, who seemed to be just stunned that he had his guard down. Grundle is laying into him. And Grabowski coming back going to the body. I mean, that is a that is a brave mood for Grundle to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a boxer, fist for fist. And Grabowski, nice overhand right. And Grundle on the back foot a little bit now, too. 2.03 to go in the first round. Oh, a nice two left hands by Grabowski. The fast, fast hands of him. <laughs> oh, body kick by Grundle. Right to the, right to the solar plexus. Is that like... Is that like you're exposed to the sun and it makes you, like, fight better? Or? Oh, oh, oh shit! Exposing to another right fist to the face. Grabowski could be what down. What the fuck? This no could way. be it. Oh, He's man. He's scrambling. Teddy has a lot of time left on the first, first round. He's got a weather this storm. Oh, and he returns the favor. Oh, shit. Oh, a couple big shots. Grundle is down. Oh, this needed the body and for good measure. These two men are going for broke. So he takes the back. Is he going for a submission? Shit, man. No, he's not. He's just taking the back of Grundle and trying to just flatten him out. Oh, a couple big shots. 17 seconds. Grabowski suddenly has the advantage in this one. He's taking the back and is just trying to pound away at Grundle. Huh? That Grundle has taken a beating at the end of round one. How in the world is this fight going to go to a second round? I can't believe I'm saying that with these two fights, with these two fighters, but good lord. It's fucking crazy. Everything you're doing is working. He's loading up. Grabowski and Grundle may have just given each other everything they got, and there's still potentially four more rounds in this fight. Mm-hmm. Holy crow, was that just a hard-hitting round. That just shows the potential these two fighters have. It's a shame only one of them can emerge as champion. Oh, no. Big shots. Oh, caught him on the way down, but so did Grabowski. Look at the same exact thing. Boom. Oh, I think he caught him right in the, in the, in the side, in the ribs on the way down. Up inside. The leg kicks are there. All right, just... Is all I can say, and there is Pai oh my indicating that it's the second round. I gotta be honest, I think with, with some of those strikes, Randy, Ready? I think we're both kind of surprised. We Ready? looked at each other after that fight was took a quick second after that round was over and kind of just Let's looked fight. at each other like, oh my how goodness, much they have left in them. Yeah, like how is this gonna go another round? Balls deep what and happens balls here? Out. Excuse me. Deep and oh, out, shit. Grundle drops him again. Oh, could this be it? Grabowski trouble getting up and Grundle. He let him up. I was dangerous. I, you got to wait for the referee to let him up if, they, if uh, that's going to be a thing. That's dangerous. You can totally beat. Oh! Grabowski! Oh! Drops him with two right hands! Grundle is down! 
Oh, he's punching. Oh, that's and it. Ponderosa stops it. I think Grundle seemed to have gone limp. Teddy Grabowski continues his reign as HCL Light Heavyweight Champion. Not kind of sad to see, but at the same time, not super shocked. What a violent, vicious yeah. main event. Yeah, good way of describing it. Fucking violent. The brain trauma that is dished out on a typical HCL show. What a fight that was. I think it was stopped by Ponderosa, but you gotta see, like, Grundle's arms fell to the canvas. He was Josh not Rosenthal defending himself. To stop to you know what? With the damage these two minute, took, I wouldn't be surprised if Ponderosa might have thought that he was unconscious. It would not shock me. Goodness oh. me. What a fight. I mean, the only thing I think we can kind of be sad about is that it's not still going on. What a fun fight. That what a great right. yeah, what a statement that was fight fun. for HCL. Quick and brutal. I mean, that is HCL in, uh, in, a, in, in one fight. Fun, quick, and brutal? Teddy Grabowski, your winner, still champion, has now defended this title three successful times under this ring. And he will continue on. He will know after the next show who his...